for the uh, organizer and also for the um, Mr. Kevin. So I'm uh, uh, let me introduce her uh, because I the first presenter for this uh, you know uh, uh, for uh, for this conference. So um, my name is Latifa. I'm from the University of Malaysia Tengganu. I'm a lecturer under the Faculty of the Economy, so Malaysia. So uh, for this slide, I just want to share my previous experience regarding, you know, related with the, uh, you know, as, as the approach. I know some of you are quite familiar with this approach. So, um, so I will, uh, you know, uh, divide my uh, my talk into the three sections. The first section is about I just give you the overview what is the LCA. So maybe some of you, you know, uh, know the definition of the LCA, like uh, the remote sensing, the the the, uh, the DIS, so MFA. So the second section, I just give you a brief a short briefing about the life cycle literacy module that uh, we have a one uh, thing in our university. We already published this module as a book, so we sell in the uh, you know uh, in Shopee now. So I hope that you can uh, find it. So uh, for the last section, we can um, I, I I will ask, uh, you know give uh, you know um, maybe a, uh, a simple uh, the, uh, you know a simple um, result that uh, have uh, that you can relate with the life cycle uh, literacy with the environmental education. Okay. So this is a further section. I think the you know the general objective uh, for my presentation today just only share my previous research project, and at the same time I want to get some uh, say, uh, some opinion from other colleagues. So the second I want to explain uh, uh, explain the basic to what is the life cycle assessment because we know that the life cycle assessment can uh, have a broad uh, you know uh, and the broad definition of a term like a life cycle cost accounting, life cycle education, life cycle, so many life cycle. At the last part, I want to share and how to use the simple uh, module of the life cycle assessment. Eh? Okay, so uh, this is just a very short uh, definition of what is the LCA. LCA like, a, uh, you know, uh, it's like the environmental accounting but then it's already put under the ISO, uh, the, the International Organization for the Standardization. And at the same time, LCA also can be defined as the, you know, uh, the technique uh, you want to study the input and output and you want to recognize which the cost part uh, happened in uh, your system through the life cycle, okay? So, um, if you can see here, there is so many analytical tools uh, that you can use, like a, as a decision spot, um, uh, you know, decision maker. So, like life cycle assessment, uh, the checklist, the metric, the cost. But if you, you know, um, if you want to uh, interested with the uh, study about the life cycle cost, you can use the life cycle cost, the CDA. Uh, we also have another tool like the associate impact assessment, the EIA. So, like um, myself, I'm more familiar with the life cycle assessment with the material flow analysis. So, but we have a, a you know, the 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 the, 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 the dif, uh, difference between the life cycle and the MFA. That life cycle, you need to put some uh, maybe some investment like to buy that software. But for the uh, material flow analysis, okay. You can um, you know, get the free software. So all these tools uh, can help the decision support uh, maker to make the best uh, result for their study. Yeah? Okay. So these are uh, what can what can we achieve with uh, with the LCA. So LCA able to help you to recognize where the hot spot conserve the variable resource. If you're interested with the energy, you can make a, you can use the LPA to study the energy nexus approach. If you're interested with the interested with the uh, water, you can use the water footprint. You can use interest interest uh, you know with the carbon you can make a the water carbon uh, the carbon footprint. Yeah LCA also uh, the carbon uh, footprint can um, relate with this LCA approach. Okay. So I'm not going to get into this. So this is a very simple procedure. 
actually the LCA have a four step. The first step, you need to define your goal, you need to define your system boundary, uh, make your own scope, okay? So after you you, 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 you you find your target, and then you need to come up with the inventory uh, analysis. I'll show you after this. Eh? So inventory analysis, like you need to find like a blue, what we call that, the blue book. Okay, if you, uh, I'll show you a okay. bit. So for the second step, you need to come up with the life cycle impact assessment. We call that life cycle impact assessment. For the second step, life cycle inventory, LCI, LCIA. And the last, you need to make your own interpretation by uh, by using the Simapro software. And then you make you need to uh, make the accessibility uh, analysis uh, analysis to help uh, you know. Find your your limitation and the uh, error, you know, with the uh, your result. Eh? Okay, so these are uh, without using the software, I'll see also can be done. Eh? Uh, because these are one of the example. If you use, if you want to count uh, by using the Excel template, okay, the Excel template by manual calculation. So these are one of the uh, you know example. If if you want to use uh, the uh, the uh, simple uh, for the rice production, <laughs> okay. So um, the quite fam uh, famous uh, with the uh, software uh, for the LCA is a Sigma Pro and also the Gavi. We have another software, okay. This uh, example that I, I quite familiar, uh, you know, uh, with myself, okay. This is Gavi software. I'll show you for the Sigma Pro software, okay. I just make, uh, go through as a random. Eh? So in the Sima Pro software, we have so many database that you can depend. Eh? Um, so like uh, if you're interested to make uh, to study the agriculture, you can use the database from the agriculture footprint, the echo event, so many data. Eh? So um, you need to familiar yourself with uh, how to put, to fit in the database into the process, the product and the waste. So, so for the uh, impact assessment, in the end, you'll be able to uh, choose what you want to study, what you want to have, or the you want to look for the impact. If you want to study the water, then you can uh, refer for the fresh water, filtration. So if you are more interested with the IPCC, the ocean depletion, then you can use for the uh, satisfaction uh, as a depletion and also the uh, so many, eh? uh, the, the global warming and success eh? yeah, okay so this is uh, one of the example for the method in the sima pro software okay so the last after you key in all your data data you use the inventory you prepare your own inventory the last part you will get result like this so from this you'll be able to uh, you know interpret your data your your result okay whether um which the highest uh you know uh, parameter keep the you know uh effect uh, in your system, okay. So this is a very example of the software. So we have so many software, but it will take a cost, right? Okay. If you want to use the Gabi, uh, they seem uh, quite expensive, like the Umberto, very expensive. But the most familiar, the very easy um, uh, among the researchers is a Sima Pro, right? okay. So this uh, example of the impact assessment you can choose if you want to uh, know the, the about the executive certification uh, okay so uh, the ways so, so many okay so this is an example of the life cycle inventory checklist once you uh, once you want to develop the inventory you need to uh, fulfill the shape okay because from the shape you'll be able to recognize the quantity of the material the waste uh, the energy uh, what kind of the input uh, you know the the the, the cost and uh, such as that, eh? okay. So, this is also the uh, example of the flow of the material because when you want to know, uh, when you want to uh, proceed with your research, you need to define your scope, your boundary, okay. When you want to study from the cradle to grave or from the gate to gate, okay, it's up to you. So, this is a very just example for you, okay. So I show you for the I have maybe a ten uh, previous project that relate with the uh, LCA. So uh, for this uh, session, I just give you four 
uh, example of my previous project that relate with the LCA. Okay, the first part, uh, we have a team to study the LCA for the mass productivity. So you just, um, so this is one, uh, you need to go to the, uh, uh, you know, uh, institute site to get the raw, uh, you know, to get the data from the farmer. So uh, once you get in, then you will get result like this, eh? Okay, the, 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 the graph like this. So this is uh, the second case study. It's about the rice production. So after you go for uh, at the harvest uh, site uh, for the rice, uh, for the um, baby site, then you need to make a site visit to the mill. So you need to know how much the quantity for the, uh, you know, the straw like that. Uh, so the baguette. So, so there is uh, the, uh, the third uh, case study, okay, for my uh, previous project. It's about the, we, 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 we did the LCA uh, for the distillation reverse osmosis plant in the one area that uh, they have the water crisis about the 45 years. So um, we set up the, the distillation plant there and we try uh, to know which the hotspot with the highest impact is to uh, the environment uh, for that surrounding. Eh? Okay, this is uh, the photo you can, this is uh, in the right, uh, uh, you know, a part you can see this a membrane, the example of the membrane used in that uh, plant, and also this is a scenario. Okay. So, the, uh, the case study for number four is about the solid waste management. So, we try and make a comparison between the, uh, you know, type of the, the way you dispose your waste, whether you want to recycle back, whether you want to, uh, you know, to dispose. How you make an open burning. So these are the result, the example of the uh, the, the, the last finding that we got. Okay. So for the section two, um, I will uh, I'll show you about the maybe a, a just a, a a short briefing about the what is the life cycle literacy module. Okay. So uh, we have a group thing. We focus for the three uh, uh group the community. Uh, the the student and also the uh, the teacher. So, uh, this we 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 con uh, you know uh, we deliver uh, our module and at the same time we we make a pre and post uh, questionnaire. Okay, we try to make a comparison. Uh, you know uh, whether the 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 participant um uh get attention or uh you know um yeah um. They, they understand our our module or not, eh? Okay. So this is an example, uh, one of the uh, uh, event that we uh, done at the school. Okay. So um, for the module actually, I put in the short uh, term LCLM stand for the life cycle uh, literacy module. Actually, is uh, you know the 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 module itself have a two objective. The first, we want to you know. Um, make a uh, participant to improve their concept toward uh, the environment conservation. Okay, so we want they know we want to uh, study whether they they, they learn uh, or they can adapt. Uh, you know uh, the the the, under, uh, the knowledge that after they, they uh, after they attend uh, their session uh, session. Eh? Okay, so um, can. You share. Can I share an um, example of my module? Eh? I want to share. Okay, this is a, a module that uh, we, this is our language, eh? uh, Malay language. Okay, so uh, we uh, just concentrate our module uh, basically for the uh, step methodology uh, that relate with the LCA. Okay, we know that LCA have the four uh, step, the, the, the goal. The, the event fee, the, the, the impact assessment, and, and the interpretation. Okay. So uh, I just maybe go to that. Okay. We have uh, the, 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 the exercise sheet here. So the student be able to recognize, you know, can take them, uh, you know, as um, complete their exercise. So, so, so very, you know, we have about uh, 60 pages, okay? 
share back to my slide for the, for the So I will put in here for the last section, eh? Okay. For the last session, um, th this is the result that we got after uh, we finished our program. That uh, actually the 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 the, the module itself can you know can be very important for the understanding to help the, the, the participant to understand the environmental changes and nature ecological balance and also the play the important role in the understanding and also they appreciate how uh, you know the environment okay so this is one of the example of our finding okay so uh, we are in progress to publish the journal. So um, it's a before and after, okay? So we want to, uh, this, uh, uh, you know, um, relationship between the life cycle uh, uh, technique with the environmental education. So uh, in terms of their attitude, their awareness, their interest, and so on. Eh? So um, these are uh, because we make uh, we uh, we apply the regulation approach, meaning that we we, we uh, apply the qualitative approach at the same time for the quantitative approach. These are the the, the finding for the qualitative approach. Eh? So we ask the participant how they feedback uh, after they join the, our program. So they they're very excited. They're very happy. To know and they practice after they're back to uh, their home they ask their parents uh, what's the level what's the definition of the level so the star if you look uh, you know in terms of the energy efficiency okay so uh, overall i think that the the the, the results show that participants very uh, change from the poor to very good eh, in terms of the understanding and also they have the, they, they give the higher higher score and also from the none of the participants remain uh, at the poor level, so they they, they have they show the their the positive attitude in terms of uh, learning of the else uh, life uh, lit, uh, life cycle literacy module. So I think that the last conclu uh, conclusion that you know um, uh, life cycle itself can once we we we. we we translate, we transform it into the module, then we distribute into the community, into the, uh, the, the, the parent, the, the, the student, the whatever, uh, the, com, uh, the, 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 the group, they very appreciate, they very appreciate because when we go to the rural area, they will not be able to access like we, 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 we do now, we did now, because they don't have the internet. So when we, we give them the module, they, they understand. Okay, they, they know they the very simple term like the interpretation. If you ask them, they don't know what's the definition of the interpretation. So the, the model is very I think the hard copy of the model is very helping them to appreciate more into the environmental conservation. So that, that's all from um, my presentation for this evening. Okay, thank you.